Time to go across again to Dictionary Corner. Vic, what have you got for us? Well, thank you to the numbers round, but of course the answer was, in fact, 98. <laughs> <laughs> this is true. A man married his Nintendo. Did you know this? No. I was not aware of this. Vic, tell us more. A man has married himself, a man has married a mannequin, and a man has married a goat. So what I've done is written a song about my fantasy marriage, which would be to adore. <laughs> so I'm going to invite Susie to play the bongos <laughs> for me. It's a beautiful love song. Are you ready? I'm, I, yeah, you I'm ready on the bongo. I'm, I'm ready. I think yeah. we're all ready. Play these things. N no idea, but I'll give it a go. Of course, you'll give it loud, a go. Loud, loud or quiet? Just keep up with the beat. <laughs> <laughs> You're the one that I adore. Even though you are a door, I love you from afar. Even when you are a jar, I want to make you mine. Your hinges are divine. I have your key. Please marry me. I love your doorknob. <laughs> I love your cat. Flap. <laughs> I love your keyhole. <laughs> if you marry me, we'll be as happy as can be. Your doorknob will shine. And the doorbells, they will chime. To Dictionary Corner. Vic, what have you got for us? Oh. I've written a song and it's about Susie and I, about our relationship between, you know, <laughs> you and me. You haven't seen it, have you? I haven't seen it. Here we are. Ready? A, B, C. You're looking at me. <laughs> I'm looking so fine. You're in ecstasy. <laughs> D, E, F. You're looking so buff. Simply sitting by you is just never enough. Thank you. One, two, three, you know what I mean. I'm looking so hot, it must seem like a dream. <laughs> X, Y, Z, take me to bed. <laughs> oh, shoot me now, because I'd rather be dead. <laughs> I didn't write that last line. <laughs> you go across to Dictionary Corner. Vic, what have you got for us? I've got this book here, which is an old book of remedies. Ooh. Mm. From 1747. I got it from, uh, from an auction, mm -hmm. and it's got some intriguing cures for, for things, such as the iliac passion, which is colic, kind of colic. Hold a live puppy constantly on the belly. <laughs> <laughs> Not a dead one, Jim. A live <laughs> puppy. Can you see that? Where are you? The iliac. Look, oh, hold a one. live puppy constantly on the belly. There you are, see? <laughs> on page 38. Nosebleeds, hold a red hot poker under the nose, or in violent cases, go into a pond or a river. <laughs> <laughs> on page 39, baldness. Rub every evening with an onion. Or electrify. <laughs> Page 67. Earache. <laughs> Put a hot roasted fig or hot roll into your ear or have tobacco smoke blown into it. <laughs> or be electrocuted. <laughs> and finally, headache. Order a tea kettle to be poured on your head or apply a fried egg. <laughs> onto the head. Or electricity. <laughs> All right, Vic Reeves, everyone. Give a round of applause. <laughs> Time to go across the victory corner now. Vic, what have you got for us? Yeah, I thought I'd do a bit of magic for you tonight. A oh. bit of magic, a bit of magical activity. <laughs> so what I'm going to do is... Um, Susie, could I borrow your shoes? <laughs> could I take your shoes off you? OK. If you don't mind. Now, here we are. They're just a normal pair of shoes. It's just putting the... Air <laughs> That's really <laughs> Just have a look. It's a normal shoe. <laughs> Just pass it around. Have a look at it. That's one of Susie's shoe. <laughs> it's a standard shoe, wouldn't you agree? Oh. <laughs> 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 oh. Susie, really? I think I'm, quite, I'm quite intrigued now. Um, <laughs> <laughs> 
What's this one? <laughs> oh. <laughs> Just Why a... is that magic? What magic? I am starting the magic, yeah? <laughs> What's this? <laughs> Ready? Here it comes. <laughs> I love floating shoes. It's a floating shoe. I love them. Sandals and sling bags. I love floating shoes. <laughs> Now he appear like home in pigeon sea and want to fly back to Susie feet. <laughs> that floating shoe. Well, I love flying shoes. <laughs> Seminar. Floating shoe. That flying shoe. <laughs> back to where you belong. Magic. It's time now to go across the dictionary corner. Vic, what have you got for us this time? Right, let's have a look. Uh, here's Susie's bag. Let's have a look and see what she... What you got in your bag, <laughs> Susie? <laughs> God, there's a lot of stuff. What's all this stuff? <laughs> let's have a look and see what you've got in here. A lot of stuff. There's your purse, some eggs. Right. <laughs> <laughs> We've got some stuff out of your out of your bag. We're gonna make some magic out of it. Okay. Right. Uh, eggs. <laughs> yeah, okay. <laughs> yeah. Some eggs there. Susie, think of a number between one and ten. Mm -hmm. For I am the magician. <laughs> <laughs> and I will <laughs> foretell <laughs> what number you're thinking of. And produce it. In this one of these size four eggs from <laughs> Fortnum and Mason. So just think of a number. Any number between uh, one and ten and write look, here's a 20p. Write the number on there and initial it. <laughs> Show it to the camera. For I will foresee the number. <laughs> Line. <laughs> there, so I've got the coin there, ready? Oh, oh, where's it gone? It's disappeared. <laughs> So now I'm going to predict that the number that you were thinking of was four. <laughs> <laughs> <Am I> right? <laughs> no. What was it? It was seven. No, oh, well, uh, forget it then. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 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 pick an egg. Pick an egg anyway. <laughs> pick an egg. Any egg. <laughs> <laughs> Crack it onto the plate. Is there a coin in there? <laughs> <laughs> I really hope there isn't. No. <laughs> <laughs> Is there not? No. It's yeah, another egg, isn't it? One. It did sound like something clinked. What? Did you think something clinked? <laughs> what made you think it would be in an egg? Because <laughs> I put Good it point. there earlier. <laughs> 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 it, might, it might be in that one. So we have a look. <laughs> <laughs> we'd be quite. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, it's not in any of them. <laughs> You get the gist of the magic. <laughs> Can I have a look at the eggs? I'm really sure I saw one come out of the first you egg. Think? Definitely something. <laughs> this <laughs> might be the most you. mental item we've ever had on the show. <laughs> oh, there it is. Is it there? It's inside the it egg. Came out oh, it's it inside went. the egg. Look, everyone. <laughs> Right. 